Hey, Gary here with 30-Minute Marketing, and we're going to be taking a look at Groove Member here inside of Groove CM Dashboard. You can see Groove Pages, Groove Funnels, Groove Sales, Groove Mail. The importance of understanding all of these components is that they work in conjunction with the other components. Now, Groove Member, you need to utilize Groove Cell and or Groove Mail to actually set up user accounts if you want to automate the process. There's a link in the description for Groove if you don't already have a lifetime account. You can check it out and get a free account and follow along. Now, when we're looking at Groove Member, you have to understand it's made up of portals and memberships. But memberships are the key here. Groove Member is about creating memberships and then creating courses. And inside of courses, you have modules, chapters, lessons, and supported files or files that support the lessons, the chapters, and the modules, things like PDF downloads. Also understand that portals only come to play if you have multiple memberships that make sense to be under one portal. So what do I mean by that? Here's an example. If we're using Groove Member, and let's say we are doing dog training, we can create a dog training portal, and then we can create an exercise membership. So dog exercise, and dog obedience membership would be two memberships that would fall under dog training portals. And of course, those courses would be all about training your dog. Now, you wouldn't put your stock investing membership with your stock courses inside of this dog training portal, but it gives you the option to give people access or the ability to find all of your memberships under one location, which is the portal or the main website. In this video, we're talking about Groove Member. We're gonna be utilizing an example called 30 Minute Groove Membership with a simple 30 minute Groove Member course with a couple modules, chapters, lessons, and files. And understand that Groove Mail is a way to actually set up and give people free access, especially if you're an affiliate marketer and you're setting this up to utilize as a bonus. You can utilize Groove Mail to put people on the email list and also give them free access into your Groove member membership. Now, Groove Sell is just that. It's a way to sell your Groove member memberships and courses. There are things like coupon codes that would allow you to give this away for free, but my main focus is utilizing Groove Mail to build an email list, especially in the context of doing this as an affiliate marketer, using the example of putting people on a list after they purchase something through you or using this as a lead magnet. There's also a manual way to add users to Groove Member. And inside of Groove Member, when you're inside the dashboard, of course, under Groove Member, this is the main dashboard and you can see members here. You can simply click add member and you can add members manually and give them different access levels. In this case, we have, or I've created a free level and a paid level. And of course, these access levels are created by you and you control those at the membership level. Inside of Groove Mail, of course, that would be accessed by Groove Mail under the main dashboard. You have what's called automations. And you can see here that when a contact subscribes to an email list, in this case called 30 Minute Groove Membership, I add them to the membership 30 Minute Groove Member. Here you can see that you can pause this, you can duplicate it, or if you were to click edit, you would see how this automation is actually set up. Of course, I named this automation 30 Minute Groove Membership, and you can see here if a contact subscribes to 30 Minute Groove Membership, the email list, then they're added to the 30 Minute Groove Membership at the free level. That would simply look like this. You have a lead or a customer that buys an affiliate product through you, and you want to use a bonus opt-in page they would opt into the email list you set up, and then the Groove automation would put that lead or that customer into the Groove membership, and they would be directed to the Groove membership login page. And we'll take a look at that here inside of Groove as well. You can see you have contacts and you have lists. Under my list, you can see that I have the 30-minute Groove membership, and here you can see that I've added one active contact inside of that list. So again, Groove Member, if you want to add people to a Groove Member membership, you can utilize Groove Mail, you can utilize Groove Cell, and you can also add them manually into your membership under Groove Member. Now let's take a look at 30-minute Groove Membership 
and take a basic overview of what goes on inside of Groove. Inside your Groove dashboard, simply click on Groove Member. And here you can see some stats for your current membership. This is the 30-minute Groove membership. But to add a new membership, you simply select New Membership. And in here you can see your memberships, or you can add a new membership by clicking New Membership and filling in Name, Description, Groove, Subdomain, the domain that you want to connect this to. This would be a domain that you actually purchase, such as 30minutemarketing.net or any domain that you have, for example, dogtraining.com, and then you would select your business niche, and then you would add your featured image, and your language is selected here, then you would simply create that membership. Take note, if you do not select a domain and you put in a Groove subdomain, you will actually get or be able to build a membership under GrooveMember.net. Once you build your membership, you simply click on Manage Membership, that will take you to all the components where you can customize your membership, manage your courses, manage your members, manage your access levels, manage your settings and analytics. Here, you simply just click on any of the manage buttons and then you can see you can customize. In this case, you can choose your template to customize your membership site and you simply just click the customize button. It loads your membership and this is a drag and drop. What you see is what you get. There's little edit buttons here in different places where you can add images. There's also a menu over here where you can walk through the different pages. You have pages here, home, about us, support, contact us. So it'll create them here inside of group member versus group pages or group funnels. Then you can control your navigation. Here again, home, about us, support, contact us. Here you can see terms and conditions and privacy policy is hidden. To change those, you just simply click. It moves it into the navigation. You see the terms and conditions are now there. You can control your footer. You can also add a logo here under the navigation. Simply move through these, the different templates that are available. Those load, you have the current templates that are available to you. Under settings, this is where you could add your favicon or any code, tracking codes, for example, if you wanted to change your open graph social share or the way that it shows up inside of Google search. And of course, any type of tracking code. And this would take you back to the customization area and to get back to the dashboard you come over here to this menu where you have home dashboard and your URLs and you simply select dashboard then you have here you can manage your courses you simply select manage courses it opens up and this is where you actually add a course course title course description sales page sales page here if someone doesn't have access to this course inside your membership if you are giving free access to say the first or a series of courses you can add your sales page in here and then that will be available for people to purchase inside of the membership you can select an instructor of course you have to create these before you start creating your course you can see that i created one for myself and then you have different categories and you can assign different categories there as well as feature image go ahead we'll cancel and you can see if i was to go into this course you'll see the way this course is laid out just like the other drag and drop editor you can edit this you can edit the background image you can add your lessons and chapters. All that is controlled over here inside of the outline where you have modules, lessons, chapters, and then lessons can be under lessons or modules. And of course, if you create this lesson, you can move this lesson up to module. You could change this lesson down to this chapter, or you can add new chapters by simply selecting the plus button. Then you can move these lessons around as you need. And that will change the outline if you go back to the module here and back up to one level go back under edit course you'll now see you have chapter lesson default lesson chapter name lesson one there's also a different component here where you can have a different layout if you wanted to change the layout you can change that as well there's also a light a dark and a custom theme right here where you can actually customize it and change all your colors background colors section colors, button, button settings, and of course, those are all right here and you can change the different colors and make all that stuff exactly the way you like it or just choose the light or the dark. Now, in this case, if you go to custom and you wanna switch back, switching theme will remove your custom theme settings. So before you go to custom, make sure that you definitely wanna go custom because if you go back and if you change it, it will change your course settings inside of the drag and drop editor so just be aware of that of course to get back to the dashboard go back to courses in this case go back to the dashboard simply select the dashboard 
Here is where you can manage your members, add new members. Of course, you simply just add a member and it will send an email. Speaking of emails, here you can see emails from Groove Member. Welcome to 30 Minute Groove Membership. This is what the email will look like. And the email, in my case, came from info at GrooveDigital.com. You can, of course, set this up so it comes from your own domain. And then it sends a little message. We have set up an account for you on 30 Minute Groove Membership. They give the email address and the password, and then they provide a link here. You simply click on that link. Or the person that bought the course, or if you were giving it away for free, for example, if you're an affiliate and you're giving this away as a bonus, they would simply click that link. Then they would simply enter their email and their password and click sign in. And that would sign them into the membership. And then they would have access to the course down here. Of course, all of this is placeholder text. This can all be deleted and edited. And you can make this a lot prettier than what I have created here. But this is just an example. Welcome to 30 Minute Groove Member Course. Awesome. Here you have the modules. Inside of module one, you have a chapter, you have lessons, you have multiple chapters, multiple lessons. Organize those all as you want. You can also see here that this can be changed by the user if they don't like this module layout. They can simply control that as well right here. So make sure you're aware of that and make sure that these two different layouts look the way that you want them to appear inside of your membership. Up here you have access to the profile or your user will have access to the profile, your terms and conditions page, your contact us page, your support page, your about us page, and the home page. Of course, all these are controlled inside of the group membership editor. Back inside your dashboard, you would customize your membership as well as manage your courses here. And you can also manage access levels. That's simply just creating different access levels. Here you can see I've given a free access level to the 30 minute Groove membership course. I've also added a paid access level here inside of the same course. If you were to click edit course access, this brings up your access levels. Here what you have is a drop down menu and inside of this you can provide instant access, you can drip access, or you can lock with an upsell offer. And if you lock these courses, you can actually create a new upsell. And you create that offer name and you walk through this menu to create an unlock access page, which would provide a page and a button here to actually go to the sales page to unlock that course inside of your membership. Of course, just exit back to that. And of course, if you wanted to give people instant access when they pay, you would just change that to the access that you want to give them. Of course, if you wanted to drip it, you would put in the different days to provide the drip. And then you would simply select save and exit. And then those are your access levels. And of course, to add an access level, you simply just add the access level and walk through the menu. We'll go back to the dashboard and you can manage your settings here. Click on manage your settings. This is your name, your description, your Groove subdomain. As you can see here, I did not select a domain, meaning I did not connect this to a .com or a .net, something that I own that I purchased through a host registrar like Namecheap. And you can see here that 30 minute Groove, my membership is gonna be hosted on the Groove subdomain. And if you were to go back to the membership and look at the URL here, it is 30 minute Groove .groove -member .net, meaning that I created this portion of the subdomain 30 minute Groove, and then they allowed me to utilize GrooveMember.net where they're hosting the actual membership for me. And I can just utilize their URL and their domain to host my membership. Back on the dashboard, you have analytics. I believe this, yes. Currently, as of July 2022, this is still coming soon. If you want to get access to your site, you can get the website URL, you can get the login URL. You can also log in as admin, or you can log in as a specific member. Then you simply just click copy URL. In this case, you would need to enter the email of the member to test their access. Or if you want to log in as admin, you can copy that URL. And then you can provide that information to anyone that wants to be an admin. Or if you just want to provide someone the login URL, you simply just select copy URL, login URL, copy to your clipboard. Then if you were to open up your browser, you can see you can simply paste that in. It's going to take me again to the login page over on 30minutegroove.groovemember.net. And there you can see I can sign in with my email and password. Then we'll go back to the dashboard here. Of course, if you need to click home under Groove Member, you can go to the Groove Member dashboard. You have your quick links where you can see all your memberships are your courses. Of course, if you were to create a portal or you wanted to create a portal here, you would select create portal. It's the same as setting up a membership. Just remember it's at the top level. And this is the top level would be the portal. If you had memberships that make sense to be in a portal, you'd add those memberships to that portal that you create inside of Groove Member. 
Then you have inside of your dashboard, you have access to all your memberships here. Every time you create a new membership, they'll be listed here. Every time you create a new course, they'll be listed here. You'll also have your portals once you create one there. Here you have access to files. This is where you want to upload your PDF files as an example. You can also, as a side note, you can actually copy this URL and you can give this away or you can add this to a page so people can download it and you could use this in the case of utilizing this as a lead magnet to deliver this free report. You can actually see how to create a landing page with group pages and deliver a lead magnet using group member for free utilizing that copy URL option inside of the files. In this video, I'll leave a card up here in the left-hand corner, as well as there is a link in the description. So in this case, when you are looking at files under group member, this is an option that you have to deliver files as a standalone option outside of group member. Moving along, you have instructors here where you can add different types of instructors. You can also see all of your members. Here you can see the analytics as well as the members area is actually broken. Again, this is July 2022. So these are currently broken as well or coming soon inside of analytics and members. So to get back to the quick links, you can go back to the dashboard. And then of course, you have access to all the other tools here. Remember, you're going to need Groove Cell as well as Groove Mail or a combination of both of them to actually get access to your Groove member memberships. So it's important to understand how all these components work together. When you're getting started, either with your free account, that'll take you over to your dashboard where you can get started with Groove Member following this quick guide setup or this quick start setup that is really targeted to people that are getting started. Or if you're like me and you purchased a lifetime access to Groove, then you can actually start taking a look and seeing how you can actually start moving this into your business to utilize this platform to maybe replace some tools that you purchased that you used in your business, as well as the reason for me making these videos is to show you what I'm looking at inside of Groove and seeing how I can either use the Groove tools to replace the tools that I'm paying monthly for, or if Groove does something better or gives me a unique opportunity to actually utilize these tools where I have these tools all in one place working together to be able to create a more harmonious environment, if you will, for the people that I have consuming my content, because that's what this is about, is about utilizing the tools to build your business, give people the information they're looking for so you can help them out by solving their problems with their content, either your own membership or utilizing it as a bonus if you're an affiliate marketer. Tons of options here. And if you have any questions, ask them in the comments. Of course, I'll be making more videos around this idea of utilizing these tools. Also check out the link in the description for my free course called Affiliating, where I show you a simple strategy to build a real profitable online business. The link for that is in the description and the pinned first comment. And again, I hope this video was helpful and I'll talk to you later. Bye.